everyone. Today we will be calculating the sum of geometric series with an unknown number of terms. So I'm going to explain how what does it mean. So in this problem right here, we know in order to calculate the sum, these are the ones that we need. First, we need the first term, a sub 1. We need the multiplier. To find the multiplier, we're going to divide these two together. So that's r equals 500 divided by 1,000 is 0 0.5. So that is our r. So already got it. And then we also need the number of terms. So how many terms there are. Now, if you want to know how we how do we get the formula for the sum of a finite geometric series, there's another video for that. Uh, please check. Um, I will put the link of that video in the description box below. So please check on that. So, uh, but if we count this, it's going to be one, two, three, four. The three dots here is telling us that there are still more in between, but we don't know what it is. So we need to find the number of terms n first. So, um, so we are going to write the first step. So I'm going to write the first step here. Step one is determine. The number of terms n. Number of terms n. Because we already have the a1, we already have the r, we already have, the, we don't have the n. So that's what we are going to determine. So this is, uh, these are the steps that we have to do. So we write, we use the equation for um, writing the equation for geometric um, series that is the t of n is equal to a sub 1, the first term, r, or the multiplier, n minus 1. So in this problem right here, we will use this as our t of n, which is, this is like the, uh, we don't know what term this is. We don't know what n was that, so that's the n, the n is missing. So I'm going to write that over here. So 3.906 two five is equal to the first term is 1000 times the uh, multiplier is 0 0.5 n is missing so we keep that as n minus 1 the next thing that we are going to do is to divide both sides by 1000 again our target is to solve for n so divide this by 1000 divide this by 1000 so we can cross these two out. So we are left with 0 0.5 to the power n minus 1. So dividing these two together would come out. You can use your calculator for that. So 0 0.0039625 after dividing it by 1,000. So the problem is we are supposed to solve for n. So how do we... How do we uh, do this? So we already have talked about this in on the previous lesson that if it's on the exponent, we are supposed to use log for it. So we log both sides. So I'm going to log um, both sides here. So I'm going to write the next step right here. So I will log both sides. So this will come out log of 0 0.00. .00 nine zero six two five is equal to the log of zero point five to the exponent n minus one now here's the thing so once we have a uh, we have an exponent here remember the property of logarithm it will go to the front so this can be rewritten as log of zero point zero zero three nine zero six two five is equal to n minus one we put the exponent to the front and that is log of zero point five from here we want the n we want to solve for the n or the number of terms so that means we are dividing both sides by a log of zero point five I divide this by log of 0 0.5, and so I can cross these two out. So I'm left with n minus 1. So it's n minus 1. When you use the calculator to divide this, this should come out 8. 
And so I will add one from both sides plus one here. So then I am left with the number of terms is actually nine. So this is our number of terms right here. So if we if we put this one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, ninth term. So there are nine total, but then again, it's 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 missing right here. So we don't know what it is. That's what we're trying to solve. Okay, so from here, we are now ready to move on to the second step. The second step is to already find the sum. So determine the, that's the step two right here. So I'm gonna write step two, find the sum. So let's find S of N. So the formula for the S of N, so I'm gonna write that up here. So again, you can check on to the other videos for the formula for um, S of N. So the formula for S of N is A sub one or the first term times one minus R to the number of terms N divided by one minus R. So we put the values in our A sub one is 1000 times one minus our R is 0 0.5. And the, the N or the number of terms that we solved is nine over one minus the R is 0 0.5. So um, using calculator on that one, so this would come out 1,000 right here times 1 minus 0 0.5 so to the power 9 is 0 0.0019, that's 1953125. So let's move this a little bit. So three, one, two, five over. So let me check. So zero point zero zero one nine five three one two five divided by zero point five. The if we if you do the math for this, so the S of N here is uh one hundred I mean one nine nine six point zero nine three seven five and this is the final answer right here so this is the sum for this geometric series if you find this video helpful please like and subscribe for more math videos see ya